you can, if a new dog is in your future, the Better Business Bureau has a warning. Chris Horgan breaks down what you need to know before you fall in love with an online picture of that perfect puppy. If you've ever seen an ad for free puppies on the internet, there's an 80% chance it's a scam. The definition of the puppy met the personality of a puppy that we were looking for. That's Judy Stroy. She and her husband wanted a beagle puppy. They searched the web to find one. She sent $400 through her money gram at Walmart, but... The next day, I received the shipping instructions for the puppy, and they requested another $750 for pet insurance for the puppy. And it's like, whoa, red flag. You know, this isn't working. So... I refused to pay the pet insurance. The Stroys were scammed out of their money, but they figured it out before any more was taken. The problem is larger than we originally thought. Monica Horton with the North Texas Better Business Bureau told us when you search online, it is hard not to find a scam. Experts tell us that when you go online and you search for a pet, 80% of the results of your search are going to be to a fraudulent site or to a puppy scam. So how do you avoid it? One way, make sure you physically see that pet beforehand. You want to show up and check out the breeder, make sure you're not dealing with a puppy mill. And in all of these situations, the consumer was asked to wire money via Western Union or provide numbers of prepaid debit cards, something such as that. So avoid wiring money. Remember, buying a pet is an emotional decision. So don't let your heart talk your head into ignoring the red flags that are barking in your brain. Chris Horgan, News Channel 6. Thank you, Chris. There is one more way you can check online. If you're looking at a picture of a puppy, you can Google search that image. Several people who did, they say they found that same picture that had been posted years before on another website.